भी दुश्मन है मेरे रजा का चल रहा था causing divisions who are out there endangering and robbing people of their iman so these are two different things those people who mention their existence who make others aware of their presence of the presence of these deviant sects are not causing the division but they are educating others they are enlightening others with these diseases as these are spiritual diseases and they are so detrimental they are so uh, harmful that they are destructive to your iman and the iman the importance of one's iman it outweighs the importance of one's body at one's uh, you know one's iman if it remains intact if you remain from the ahlu sunnah wal jamaa your body is even if it is affected with disease and your iman remains intact you are safe if a person has a tandurust a body which has sihat which is blessed with good health but his iman it is polluted and contaminated with the disease the ultimate disease of kufr the ultimate disease of shirk the ultimate disease of blasphemy of of allah azza wa jal blasphemy of rasulullah alayhi salatu wasalam blasphemy of the sahaba blasphemy of the ahlul bayt blasphemy of the awliya e kiram then you draw the have an ill body then have an ill iman ill faith because the articles of faith must be consistent with the quran and sunnah so time and time again we repeat this we repeat these words because uh, our deeds are only going to benefit us if we are sahihul aqeedah okay allah azza wa jal he may overlook our shortcoming as far as the establishment of good deeds is concerned but when it comes to aqida then allah azza wa jal we will be judged in accordance with our belief our belief must be correct in relation to the articles of faith and we must remain with such people who have and who promote the correct belief